there's a few things that you're gonna want to get before um, you start everything I got everything I used for this I got at Walmart um, I think everything came under I want to say ten dollars might have came to like twelve dollars or so um, but everything was super cheap um, yeah so anyway let's get started first thing that you're gonna need is some um, pliers these are these are going to be for um, closing the clasps um, and it also um, for cutting the chain so you're going to want to make sure the ones that you get um, do both cutting the chain and um, are able to uh, close the clasps um, next thing that you're going to want to get is um, the metal chain um, at the Walmart I went to they had a few different colors you can get either um, like a brassy one silver or gold so um, pick whatever one you had um, this was three to 350 I believe at the Walmart I went to and it's um, 70 inches long that seems wrong but um, anyway it was plenty for making um, one of them and then um, I opened this already but um, This um, is just the clasps that you're going to need to uh, attach the chains together. So just one package of these, and again, these were $3.50, so super cheap. And the, um, these guys were, I think, $6, so um, yeah, I think everything came to under $15. Okay, so um, next you want to decide how you want your um, headband to look, uh, if you want the... Um, if you want it to go around twice or if you just want it to go around once or um, what kind of design you want. There's so many different things. Um, so just use the chain it. and um, just take a mirror and um, measure however you want it to look. So I like mine to be a little bit loose. So about like so. And then um, I prefer to have um, one of these little clasps open. It's totally hard to see. But just have one of these little guys open so that you can just hook it on the chain. And you'll be ready to go. Okay, so, so now that you've measured there. your head around once and um, now if you want to do the double loop like how I had mine um, you can decide if um, how you want it to go I like for this one of mine I'm gonna make my um, second loop a little bit shorter so it's a little bit hard to see because it's silver but um, I'm just gonna make my uh, second loop a little bit shorter than my my first loop so here's the first loop here you can see it's a little bit longer and my second loop I'm just gonna make about an inch shorter just so it'll be a bit tighter so I'm just going to kind of pinch with my finger where I want it and my hook is up here I'm just going to put it in the hook and it's hard when you have chubby fingers. And then you can take the end of the first end and just hook it in here as well. This is all that's going in this little hook, so you can just go ahead and with the pliers, just squeeze it together. So I just hold all the chains that are in there in one hand and uh, squeeze it together. Make sure you squeeze it together really good so it's... Okay, it so um, of course my camera died and now the sun is um, going down. The lighting changed a bit, so... Um, Anyway, whatever, hopefully, <laughs> hopefully it'll still be okay. So the next part we're going to do is measure the part that goes down the middle. That's what you want um, 
that's how I'm going to do mine. So anyway, the easiest way to do this is just to put it on and measure it that way. So you can see by making the first one a bit shorter, it hangs a little bit different, and by making this one longer, it hangs down longer. So um, you can just feel with your hands, you don't really need a mirror at the back. Uh, the easiest way to do it is just pinch where the, where the two meet there, um, and then you can just take it off again. And then just take another little hook and loop it in there. And those are the only the only thing that's going in there, so you can just close it up. Okay, so now that you have connected the center part, um, there will be a little bit left over. Um, if you want, you can leave this dangling um, down the back. I don't really want to, um, I don't really like that look, so I'm just going to cut it off, and that's why um, I said to get the pliers that um, cut as well. And like I said, the sun is shining right in my eyes, but anyway, um, so put them in this part of the pliers here and any chain that you want to cut just put it right in there and it'll cut it really easily just press hard anyway this is the finished look um, comment below let me know what you think of it um, like I said I was inspired by Coachella and um, all the music festivals going on, um, Nicole Richie and Fashion Star, things I've seen online, that sort of thing. Um, yeah, let me know what you think, let me know if you tried it at home, and yeah, thanks so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. Mm -hmm.